Police have been asked to investigate a campaign attacking Marion Council for flying a gay pride flag outside its council chamber. A local councillor and the Greens have likened it to gay hate literature. The business card-sized item criticises a Marion Council decision to permanently display the rainbow flag outside its chambers. The back of the card lists alleged facts about the health of gay men in Australia. One councillor says it's been posted in local letterboxes and to the council, as well as left lying around Marion Shopping Centre. I'm surprised and disappointed. Uh, is this uh, Marion in 1956 or is it uh, Marion in 2015? I, I, I am quite taken back, really. Earlier this month, Marion Council moved for the flag to be displayed with the motion supported by six votes to five. A council meeting next week will look at rescinding the motion, but Mr Hull hopes his colleagues don't succumb to pressure to remove the flag. There are too many politicians that stand for nothing, um, and I hope my colleagues on the council will actually see that this is an important issue, that with respect they stand their ground. The Greens say opposition to the flag is homophobic and there should be laws to punish people who run hate campaigns. And this is uh, hate propaganda. This is there to fuel hatred and fear and it should be combated not just by the leadership of the council but with the full force of the law where that law can be applied. Mr Hull says he's referred the matter to police to investigate if any law has been broken by posting the card in private letterboxes. Chris McLaughlin, ABC News, Adelaide.